Thank you very much, Madam Chair. Yes, this is SCA 9, and I'd like to thank you for the thoughtful analysis and uh, also happy to take the suggested amendments as author's amendments. SCA 9 would also amend the state constitution to lower the voter approval threshold from two-thirds to 55 percent to fund economic development programs. As we all know very well, in 2011, the state's fiscal problems led to the dissolution of redevelopment agencies, leaving municipalities without a comprehensive financial tool for economic development. Many cities and counties relied on rede redevelopment funds for housing, transportation, retail, as well as other civic development projects to revitalize blighted areas and for the overall economic development benefits of their communities. For example, in my city, the city of Hayward worked on a downtown rehabilitation project which improved the city's downtown sidewalks and provided new lighting, bus shelters, and in an area that had suffered from underdevelopment for many, many years. In addition, the city of San Leandro in my district also built a senior community center, which was a high priority for the community to enrich the lives of seniors by offering opportunities and health-related activities. The center also serves as an emergency operations center in the event of large-scale crisis or, or earthquakes, as we have in my district. These important community projects used RDA funds. With the dissolution of the RDA agencies, we now need to look to other ways to place funding and allow our local communities tools to continue to build these projects that are extremely important for our districts. Uh, if local governments are able to continue to foster job growth and, and advance economic development projects, this would be a very important alternative financing option. I ask for your I vote. All right.